what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back it's your boy terror by reacts here back in the house once again for another episode of sons of anarchy i should have just did a double upload but i felt the need to do another episode today um so episode five great episode man great episode um things are really coming to a head with everything that is going on you know um it, it's to the point where i'm just like there's no way everybody's gonna come out of this unscathed you know what i'm saying like there's going to be a major death and it's like i can see it coming <laughs> you know what i'm saying it's like i can see it coming man it's it's just it's to the point where i feel like Jax is going to die i feel like i i think Gemma, as i said at the beginning of the season i think Gemma is probably going to be the ultimate person that you know ends up being the villain of the story like the ultimate villain of the story like the manipulation that she's doing right now even though she got really close to death in the last episode i just feel like her manipulation her lying and all of this other stuff even though she's doing that to save her own tail all in all this entire story was built around her being the mother figure for this club and the things that she has done to protect the club and all of this other stuff like you can make a huge argument that this entire story was built around Gemma the character right so I don't feel like Jax is going to I feel like there's something gonna happen to Jax I feel like he's gonna end up just like his daddy I don't think the club is going to kill him um I don't know I feel like people like Chibs, maybe, you know, Tig, I, I don't know, man, like, I don't know, I don't even know what to tell y'all, because at this point, it's just like, I want everybody to survive, but, but the way out of season is going, it's like they're leading up to something, and I feel like, for some reason, I feel like Juice, you know what I'm saying, I feel like the Juice is probably going to, I don't know, turn himself in. I, I don't know i feel like juice is probably gonna go to the club or something and just confess to them about what happened and probably try to clear himself and try to get them off of the chinese because he doesn't know why the chinese did what they did you get what i'm saying he's out here paranoid as hell um you know answer is cleaning up his mess and now you know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't think he's gonna kill Gemma. As I said, I don't I don't think I don't know because he's so off right now. Like, would he kill Gemma? I don't think you know, I don't feel like he would. But at the same time, you can't even predict to say because he's so unpredictable at this point, is is like he doesn't use his head before he acts at this point. So what do you what what do you, what do you even <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So what do you even think of him? So let's jump into this next episode, episode six. Hopefully you guys enjoy it because it's going to be a while. <laughs> it's going to be another week before you guys see any more episodes from me. So let's see how we get it because I got two more TV shows that are that is going to be premiering on the channel um, this week as well. So I got to get those videos edited. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much. I appreciate y'all. And I will catch you guys at the end for the review. Surprised? Not. <laughs> the problem with the whole Wendy thing is like she did something that's <laughs> a mint flavored blowjob, really? Oh, yeah, Bob. Sure, Bob. Why don't you check it out, Dad? Who 
<laughs> yes, too soon. <laughs> but he ain't lying though. <laughs> he ain't lying. Guys are like that. That they don't care. It might be a new aesthetic. <laughs> it's all sorts of freaks out there. He's still going to want to manage that place, though. How can you even eat there? Like, I, I would be so disgusted to be in a crime scene like that. Blood everywhere still. Like, I mean, these are gangsters. So they, I mean, but still, to be able to even... Ugh. <laughs> I joke about it now, but I think I I think at some point Nira is going to find out what Gemma did. Yeah, I'm saying. I don't know. Yeah. The hype is real. Yeah, it was 
talking to <laughs> her. I think she's talking to herself. <laughs> I know this girl from somewhere. I just... I know this girl from somewhere. I just can't pick her out from... I know her from somewhere, not in real life, but in from some other show that I've watched in the past. <laughs> Is he planning to go to the club? <laughs> the jokes are never done. <laughs> Get all the bullet holes, man.
<laughs> what are you gonna do? She also sings. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be kidding me.
This is the last thing I thought he would do. Ah, uh, let's pause. Let's pause for part two. That is the last thing I expected Juice to do. Like, on some serious jump, bro. It's crazy. He's still wearing his cut, too. Oh, my God. That's going to boil their blood. <laughs> How you gonna get out of this, Juice?
Man, everything just seems like it's coming together. <laughs> but it's... It's serious business, man. <laughs> Body better works out. <laughs> there is no way. I feel like Juice. There is no way that they're going to keep him. I knew it. <laughs> I knew they was going to take his cut, bro. They have to. He's still walking around with that stuff. Like... <laughs> no matter what, these guys are loyal to a fault. Like him doing that. I was, it did not surprise me that they went, that they went to Jax because. Oh. <laughs> it's amazing how anything it happens in real life all the time where it, you know convicted drug dealers they still conduct business <laughs> out of prison it's so weird dude
still run their cartels out of prison and stuff like that. I've been watching some documentaries lately about the cartel, man. Like, that old dude, <laughs> when they get sent back to America for their sentences and stuff, and they still running their drug business <laughs> out of jail. Oh, my God. No. Yeah, but once Nero comes back, he's gonna ask like, "How the hell did Juice end up with your with your with your car?" Things are gonna get dicey. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, she's talking. Is it like Dawn or something? What's this? Hurting, hurting my eyes, man, looking at this. <laughs> Just for you. <laughs> don't even know what the hell that is could be salt <laughs> just snort it <laughs>
Why does he have your <laughs> yeah? Yeah, how do he get his hands on it? He gonna be like he jumped me. <laughs> Don't lie. <laughs> Come on, Nero, press a little more. Press a little more, man. I want you to know the truth, bro. I wonder if he's going to put two and two together. He's like, why are you crying? <laughs> This is not good for anybody, man. They just left a bunch of death <laughs> in front of Pope on Pope property. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, we know that. <laughs> we know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's how it's less like. Now I take this dude serious, man. What's gonna be Juice? Juice's fate? Juice is gonna die! Juice is gonna die. <laughs> I can't even vouch for him at this point. It's just like, does he deserve to die? Probably not, but <laughs> club rules. Club rules. Dead man walking. <laughs> Dead man walking. Hootie hoo. <laughs> Oh, man. What an episode, man. What an episode. I'm feeling it today. I'm feeling it today, man. My God. Let's go to the review.
I'm not gonna lie, man. I miss watching Sons of Anarchy. I do. I do. Um, so I'm gonna try to, to get these episodes, get this off the docket so that we can move on um, to the other shows. So I'll probably just spend some more time doing this and then um, then I'll move on to the next one because I really do need to get this off the docket. But I do miss watching it. Sons of Anarchy. I wish it had a couple more seasons. <laughs> it's just such a fun show to watch. And... I don't know. I guess in some ways I don't want it to end. That's why I've been kind of like delaying it too. Like, I don't know. <laughs> but it's such a good show, man. Um, Gemma. Gemma, 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 Gemma. When will you tell the truth? When is somebody going to find out what Gemma has done? And I think Nero is probably going to, to um, pry her to wonder, why are you crying? What truth are you talking about? What are you talking about if Juice tells the truth? What's going to happen? You know what I'm saying? Like, now Unser is probably going to find out that the Suns was there. That they, though, that's who they were trailing. So Unser is probably going to think that the Suns had something to do with attacking his friend. Yo, she's, shit is about to go wild. It's about to go wild in this series. So... I'm definitely looking forward to see what's going to happen next. It's not going to be today, but <laughs> in any case, man, this has been a journey and I can't wait to see what they're going to come up with to end this season. Um, Gemma is starting to crumble. She didn't want them to get their hands on juice because he might just spill the beans to save his ass or he might go down and be like, I'm not going to rat out. Gemma you know we kind of knew that Alvarez wasn't going to just take juice up on his offer you get what I'm saying because of all these motor clubs right they may be warring against each other but there's still a certain level there's still these club rules and these etiquette this club etiquette that they have that's just like those it, it, it's like these i don't want to say unwritten rules but it, they kind of are the <laughs> unwritten rules you know what i'm saying that they go by that's just like it's standard across the board because they may be fighting over territory and all of this other stuff but there's just some standard things about having a motor club or being a criminal rather <laughs> or, or being a criminal that's just you just don't do you get what i'm saying so I never expected them to do that. Juice going to them was very unexpected. I didn't think he would have tried to do that because it just seems very dumb on his part. Because I'm like, you've been around club these clubs for years. Why, why did you think that this was going to happen? You know what I'm saying? Like, what made you thought that they were not going to give you up? you you know you know out of everything that you could have thought of to get out of town right you chose this idea let me go to the mexicans to get across the border no doesn't work like that man like let me go <laughs> it's just dumb to me but in any case, guys, not going to hold y'all for too long, man. I just can't wait to see what's going to happen next. Everything is kind of coming to a bump. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, Nero is in a very particular situation in this, in this entire thing also. Because he's like a neutral party that a lot of this information is he's, he's like a He's like in the middle of everything. He's like standing in the middle, just kind of finding out things. Um, he's like us, the audience. That's just kind of just gets thrown into these situations with everybody else. And he's just finding these things out because of his relationship with everybody else. So interesting, very interesting. There also, it was a good, it's crazy how Jax just comes up with these ideas on the spot to just solve these issues that he's having when something doesn't work out there's always this backup that he just comes out on a plan um the whole situation with the lane you know that revenge plot and get him out and dumping it on you know um pope's properties or whatever 
um let's see how that's going to play out in the upcoming episodes so i'm looking for it man i'm definitely looking for it. hope you guys are too these, these two episodes that i watched today were fire appreciate you guys nonetheless um don't forget to like the video don't forget to comment and i will catch you guys later and as always man terabyte reacts out peace